Hello guys, welcome back to Seven Engineering YouTube channel. Please subscribe our channel for daily Seven Engineering videos. And today lecture we are going to find out the quantity of cement, sand, and aggregate for this RCC beam. This is any beam given to us, and we are interested to find the quantity of cement, sand, and aggregate for this beam. And let's suppose that this beam is made up of M20 grade. So this means that it has the compressive strength of 20 megapascal. And we know that M20 grade of concrete has a mixed ratio of 1, ratio 1.5, ratio 3. Where 1 ratio, the first one shows the cement, the second shows the sand, and the third ratio shows the aggregate. So this is M20 grade concrete and this is used in the construction of this beam and this is the ratio for the M20 grade of concrete where M shows the mix and 20 shows the strength of the concrete in the unit of megapascal. So now to start with the quantities, first we have to find out the weight volume of the beam. The weight volume of the concrete used in this beam is equal to the length multiplied by the breadth multiplied by the height. So the length is 10 meter of this beam and the two dimension one is this height or thickness and this is the breadth or width of the beam so these are 0.3 and 0.4 meter so the total width volume is equal to 1.2 cubic meter so this is the width volume of this concrete beam now to find out the dry volume for this beam dry volume we will multiply with the 1.54 the width volume now the question is that why I multiply this width volume by the factor of 1.54. As we know that this is RCC beam is made up of the concrete. So this concrete already has water mixed in this beam. So the width volume of the concrete is less. So what we do, we multiply by a factor in order to get the dry volume because the dry volume has no water. So the dry volume of the concrete is always greater than the wet volume because the wet volume has the water inside this and due to which its volume squeezes and decreases. So the dry volume is always equal to the 1.54 multiplied by the wet volume. So now 1.54 is before multiplying it with the wet volume which is 1.2. So it comes out to be 1.84 cubic meter. So this is the dry volume of the concrete used in this beam. Now to find out each quantity, we have to sum up of this ratio. So sum of the ratio is equal to the, these are 1, 1 1.5 and 3. So I will add these ratios. I got 5.5. So this is the sum of the ratio. Now the cement quantity, it is equal to the, the cement ratio, which is 1 dividing by the total ratio which is 5.5 multiplying it with the dry volume which is 1.84 so this is a simple formula in order to calculate the quantity of cement sand and aggregate you should put the individual ratio which is 1 in case of the cement and then you should divide by the total value which is 5.5 and then multiply it with the dry volume of the concrete so we will get the quantity of the cement is equal to the 0.33 cubic meter now to find out the number of bricks for cement what should we do here we know that the density of the cement is equal to the 1440 kilogram per cubic meter so the weight of the cement weight of cement so weight of cement equal to 0.33 is the quantity of semen in cubic meter multiplying it with the density which is 1440 kilogram per cubic meter so cubic meter cubic meter will be cancelled and we got here 475 kilogram of the cement now one bag of cement one bag of cement is 50 kilogram of cement so the total number of bags the total number of bags of cement will be equal to the 475 dividing by 50 we got almost 9.5 bags of cement 
So 9.5 bags of cement are used in this concrete beam. Now to find out the sand quantity, so it is equal to the sand is equal to the similarly using this formula, the ratio of each sand which is 1.5, dividing it by the total which is 5.5, multiplying it with the dry volume which is 1.84, so we got 0 0.50 cubic meter. Now this is the volume of the sand in cubic meter. Now the density of the sand is equal to 1450 kilogram per cubic meter. So the weight of the sand comes out to be, if you multiply this 0 0.50 with the density, So we got 725 kilogram of the sand. So this is the weight of the sand. Now to find out the aggregate. Similarly, 3 is the individual ratio. Dividing it by the total ratio which is 5.5. Multiplying it with the dry volume which is 1.84. So we got 1 cubic meter. Now the density of the aggregate is 1500 kilogram per cubic meter so if we multiply these two values we will find the aggregate weight so weight of aggregate is equal to the 1 multiply with the 1500 so we got 1500 kilogram of the aggregate so 1500 kilogram aggregate is used in this beam while 725 kilogram of sand is used and 475 kilogram of cement is used in this RCC beam. Hope you guys understand how to find out each quantity and don't forget to subscribe our channel for daily sound engineering videos. Thank you for watching our video.